हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू कोड विद अनुराग वेयर यू कैन फाइंड लेटेस्ट जॉब अपडेट्स एंड कंप्लीट प्लेसमेंट प्रिपरेशन फाइनली ऑन योर डिमांड आई एम हेयर विद दिस वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एल डिस्कस एल एन टी टी आर प्लस एच आर इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो आई डिस्कस सम इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स टू प्रिपेयर फॉर टेक्निकल राउंड ऑफ एल एन टी प्लीज नोट दिस वीडियो इज ओनली फॉर केमिकल ब्रांच जी आई एस ब्रांच मेटेलर्जी ब्रांच एंड माइनिंग ब्रांच कैंडिडेट्स and i have already uploaded a video for cse it civil mechanical electrical electronics or related branch candidates video i have already uploaded so you can watch that video either by clicking on this i button or you can directly find link of that video in the description box so this video is only for these four branches so let's get started uh, but before we starting the video i want to say something uh, for this video i am working from last few days i talked with lot of candidates who gave their interview in lnt last year and i collected some common questions which i'll share in this video so for this video i really did lot of hard work so if you think i deserve something for this video please give a like to this video and subscribe this channel that's enough for me so now let's get started without wasting any time so first let's discuss about the important topics for the interview so first let's discuss about the chemical branch candidates after that i'll discuss for other branch candidates so for chemical branch candidates uh, your resume is very very important after that your final year projects then your fluid mechanics topic then heat transfer then mass transfer so these are the some important topics please note your resume and your final year projects are very very important more than 70% questions interviewer will ask from your resume and from your final year project and please note this is for graduate engineer trainee role so obviously uh, you can expect some uh, technical questions like questions from c programming language you can expect some, some basic code basic questions okay so from technical skills and most of the questions interviewer will ask from your resume so please prepare your resume very very well now let's discuss for metallurgy branch candidates so for metallurgy branch candidates also your resume and your final year projects are very very important after that your course subject in the from your core subjects important topics are extraction metallurgy hydro metallurgy electrode metallurgy and thermodynamics these are some important topics you have to prepare but first prepare your final year project and your resume most of the questions interviewer will ask from your resume and from your final year projects and obviously uh, this uh, this interview is going for graduate engineer trainee role it means uh, this is purely technical job so you can expect uh, some technical questions also in the interview okay so please prepare some uh, basic core basic questions on c programming language or basic questions on java or on oops concept some basic basic questions okay other than your prepare your resume first your resume is very very important now after that let's discuss for mining branch candidates so for mining branch candidate uh important topics are first one is your, is your resume your resume is very very important after that your final year projects so this is again a very important topic uh i mean these two things are do and die things now, one is your resume second one is your projects because most most of the questions will be from your resume and from your final year projects so please prepare these two things after that from your core subjects uh, you have to prepare these topics like blasting operation drilling charging mining industry dump management mine mine excavation haul road design cost reduction initiative safe uh, safety device safety devices in excavation mechanics so these are the some important topics you have to prepare and please note this is a technical job so you are going to give interview for technical job role that's why you can expect some technical questions also like from questions from oops concept from c programming language you can expect some basic questions but please prepare your resume very well most of the questions interviewer will ask from your resume okay now let's discuss for gis branch candidates so for gis branch candidates uh, your resume your final year projects are very very important after that main components of gis gis commands link display geo statistics geo coding and geo referencing gps hydraulic hydraulical modeling sdss these are the some important topics you have to prepare but first prepare your resume because most of the questions interviewer will ask from your resume so prepare your resume very very well and this is a technical job so you are going to give interview in the technical job so you can expect 
some technical questions also so please prepare some technical questions also uh, but after your resume your resume is very very important okay after that you can prepare some technical questions also questions from c programming language basic questions uh, questions from uh, oops concept like that okay now let's discuss about the technical interview questions which were asked uh, last year from the candidates so these are the some real interview questions first let's discuss about the chemical branch candidates so first question number 1 is can you explain the third law of uh, thermodynamics second one is question number 2 is can you explain the difference between unit operation and a unit process please note uh, i didn't mention any answer of these questions because you can easily find the answer of all the questions on the google so that's why i didn't mention any answer okay so you can easily find the answer on the google now question number 3 is what is what is flow control can you explain how it is used in a chemical engineering process question number 4 is what are the three classes of an organic solvent question number 5 is what is the material requirement planning question number 6 is what are the three classes of organic solvent okay sorry uh, the question number 4 and question number 6 is repeated sorry sorry for this question number 7 what are pvcs question number 8 is what are the characteristics uh, that if that affect the flow of the bulk solids and how question number 9 is what is carbon what is carbon sequestration question number 10 is what is the critical radius of insulation question number 11 is what is the black body okay so these are the some important questions which were asked last year from the candidates so you can prepare these questions okay but don't rely only on these questions prepare all the topics your core subject and your your resume very very well okay and your final year projects now let's discuss for metallurgy branch candidates so question number 1 is which liquid can dissolve gold question number 2 is what is the formula to calculate the firing order of an engine question number 3 is what is vacuum induction melting question number 4 is question number 3 was previous question number 4 is how can you separate gold from mercury question number 5 is which is the only liquid in which gold is dissolved question number 6 is tell me some of the innovation in metallurgical field question number 7 is what is carbide question number 8 is what is the what are the application of manganese steel question number 9 is at what temperature oxidation uh, corrosion occurs okay so these are the some important questions which were asked from the candidates last year so please prepare these questions and don't rely on these questions because um, in your in your interview questions may be different okay it's totally up to the interviewer's mind so please prepare all the topics which are in your resume and your core subject and your favorite subject okay and main important thing whatever you will mention in your introduction most of the questions interviewer will ask from your introduction okay now question number 9 sorry let's discuss for gis branch candidates so for gis branch candidate uh, question number 1 explain the difference between join and relate, relate. Uh, question number 2 is what is a linked display question number 3 is why are geo statistics important question number 4 is what are the main components of gis question number 5 is explain the difference between geo coding and geo referencing question number 6 is what is the basic work of a gis technician question number 7 is what is remote sensing question number 8 is what is gis data data mining mining sorry here uh, the spelling mistake gis data mining uh, question number 9 is what is hydraulical uh, modeling question number 10 is what is chart junk question number 11 is tell me any four advantages of gis question number 12 is what is the difference between gis and lis so now let's discuss uh, for mining branch candidates okay for mining branch candidates question number 1 is what is the latest technologies used in mining mining industry question number 2 is what is drilling charges question number 3 is what is blasting operation question number 4 is what do you know about dump management question number 5 is what is mine excavation question number 6 is explain about hall road design question number 7 is what is cost reduction initiative question number 8 is which safety device used in excavation machines 
क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन इज हाउ कैन वी अंडरग्राउंड वर्किंग हाउ कैन वी डू अंडरग्राउंड वर्किंग क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन इज हाउ ब्लास्टिंग सिस्टम इज अचीव इन द अंडरग्राउंड माइंस so these are the some important questions for mining branch candidates which are asked last year from the candidates uh, please don't rely only on these questions because in your interview questions may be different because it totally depends upon the interviewer okay mood of the interviewer so uh, please prepare uh, prepare all the important topics uh, from your resume your resume is very very important whatever you have mentioned in your resume most of the questions will be from your resume and some technical questions also you can expect because you are going to give graduate engineer trainee role interview okay so you can expect some technical questions also okay now let's discuss hr interview questions so hr interview questions question number one and please note these these ten questions ten hr interview questions are common for all the candidates okay so question number one is introduce yourself question number two is where do you see yourself after five years question number three is who is the current ceo of lnt question number four is what do you know about our company question number five is why do you want to join lnt question number six why should we hire you question number seven are you willing to relocate if required question number 8 what are your strengths and weakness question number 9 what is your biggest achievement so far question number 10 is do you have any question so these are the some important questions uh, you can prepare you these are some do and die topics you will definitely get um, at least four or five questions from these 10 questions okay so very very high chance and please note uh, in the last whenever interviewer uh, give you opportunity interviewer give you a opportunity to ask any question then please take advantage of that opportunity i mean uh, if interviewer will ask any question then um, you must have to ask any question if you will not ask any question from the interviewer then interviewer will think that you are not interested for this job role but if you will ask any question the interviewer will think that you are interested in in this job now the question is what question you should ask from the interviewer if interviewer give this opportunity so uh, you can ask any question like uh, for example what will be the your day to day responsibilities in the company so you can ask like this type of question any question whatever you can ask that's enough that's fine you can ask okay yeah that's it from my side in this video if you have any doubt please feel free to ask in comment box you can join our telegram channel i'll provide link in the description box if you think this video is helpful like this video and subscribe this channel for more such videos thank you for watching this video